Oh, this entire room smells like cedar, and I love it. So I just got back from the lumber yard, first time ever being there, and got a bunch of different species and stuff that I'm I'm gonna be super excited to work with here coming up in the in the next several months. So we've got some oak here, a couple couple boards. I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to use that on. I just know that I love working with oak and I wanted some. So, got it. Uh, move those over real quick. And so here, mahogany. Very beautiful. Got some cherry. I mean, really, I'm going to say very beautiful on every one of these. Because... <laughs> uh, I just, I love, I love it. Every one of these species. And there was a lot more that I wanted. I just couldn't get everything. I mean, gotta, gotta stay within some kind of budget. <laughs> but yeah, there's, that's all cherry. And these are all scrap cutoffs because I had to get it cut off at a maximum of seven feet to fit in my car. I did not bring my trailer. Uh, when I went to the lumber yard, so some of these are scraps that'll get used for some small projects. Who knows? We'll see. And then right here, gorgeous walnut. And um, this sees so everything we've seen so far is four quarters, except for the mahogany, which is six quarters, and this this piece of walnut here is eight quarters. And it is just, I love walnut. I mean, again, I, all of these, <laughs> I just love the, the look of, of wood in general. I just, I love it. Here's some of that cedar, red cedar. This is going to be featured in a uh, upcoming project soon for uh, Lazy Susan that I'm going to be building. So I've got two boards that are uh, eight inches wide and two boards that are four inches wide. And so I wasn't hundred percent sure how I wanted to, uh, these are going to be biscuit joined together when I do that project. And, um, the big boards look, I mean, they, they have a little bit of a different look than the small boards. So the, just the grain pattern. And so let's see if the camera, there we go. Uh, so I wasn't hundred hundred percent sure like which grain pattern I wanted to go with, uh, for this particular build. So I just got two of each. And, um, I mean, they will get used for something, obviously, um, all the extras. So, I like getting extra just because I don't want to have to go to back. That's a 30-minute drive. I don't want to have to go back there, you know, every two weeks. This is enough to last me um, several months, I would say. Here's some bird's eye maple. Very pretty wood. And then these last four down here are all uh, regular hard maple. And I still love the way that looks too. I mean, again, <laughs> all of it. <laughs> like the way all of it looks, so. Yeah, so here's some of the scraps, but uh, it's all gonna be, that's all regular maple. Here's some uh, bird's eye. Some of that bird's eye that was cut off. So yeah, this is just a quick update um, to show what's what's going on. And we have some awesome project wood, wood to uh, start some cool things with here soon. So stay tuned.